My name is Andrew Kelly and it's my privilege to be the Yarra Riverkeeper. My name is Karine Traeger and I'm the CEO from the Yarra Riverkeeper. We are a river city. We settled here because of the river and we're still here because of the river. I feel very sentimental about this river because I grew up not too far from its banks. The litter and polystyrene project in the Yarra was about figuring out what was in the river. We were really fortunate that we had this partnership with the Clean Water Group. They're a great group. They really think things through and it really helped us think things through. And what we worked out was that 50%, 50% of the rubbish in the river is polystyrene. That was actually coming from building sites, industrial sites, shopping centres. So that was a big step forward for us. As we know, polystyrene lasts for 500 years and pollutes waterways, affects wildlife and flora. So that's why it's so important to track it, to try to push better policy for that. The activities that we undertook was sampling the litter traps. So we would sample them over a period of, uh, I think it was a year, 18 months. We vacuumed the reed beds and then we had the public Yarra River blitzes. We uh, got people out in kayaks to pick up rubbish on the river and they were fantastic fun. Some of the things that we're really proud of is that we vacuumed up 17,500 kilos of vacuumed waste. And I'm also really proud that the community collected 665 kilos of waste. I think right now the world's changing. We need to start getting better in terms of how we become more sustainable as human beings, you know, businesses, corporations, and that's why we have to find a response for climate change and what's happening. If we don't act right now, in the next 20, 30 years, it's going to be too late.